So everyone's focused on Ukraine, Russia, Iran, Hezbollah, the Houthis, Israel, all these things. They're not really focused on all the other conflicts all over the world. Go Google it. It is happening everywhere. China, Taiwan is another tension point everybody's watching. But here's another one no one's really focused on that's also causing chaos. Philippines accuses China of using bladed weapons in a major South China Sea escalation. The Philippines accused China's Coast Guard of launching a brutal assault with bladed weapons during a South China Sea clash earlier in the week. The major escalation in a festering dispute that threatens to drag the United States into another conflict. The incident is the latest in a series of increasingly fraught confrontations in the resource-rich and strategically important waterway. But the scenes captured in the footage mark an inflection point in the long-simmering tensions, with China adopting new, more aggressive tactics that analysts say are calculated to test how the Philippines and its key ally, America, will respond. In a post on X, America responded. The U.S. condemns China's aggressive, dangerous maneuvers which caused bodily injury, one of them lost a finger, and damaged Philippine vessels. The end. Don't do that again. Naughty. Same way they went to Hezbollah and said, don't you dare attack Israel in the north. Bad. And then they just continued attacking. Every day, all day, all the time, right now, while I'm talking, still happening. What are you going to do about it? Don't know. We're taking Biden for an ice cream. And then we have a LGBTQ thing at the White House. We, we'll see if we can schedule you somewhere when we get aggressive. But we can't get aggressive right now because we're busy with... Um, pronouns and things like that in the military. See the problem here. It's a mad time to be alive. Fortunately, we have Jesus.